record again. So a uh, really good question. How do we calculate code complexity um, in Augur? And the, the short answer is that inside of the value worker, so if we go to github.com chaos auger, um, we have all of the workers and inside the value worker, we import um, a bunch of files and have a sub process. So the worker type is value worker, get URL, define model and then generate value data. And then so for each record, um, this basically runs a program called SCC on a repo and stores the results in a database. And SCC is just simply looking for the Git repository. And what it does is it runs a complexity calculation over every file. Um, and if we go to the larger GitHub SCC, it's actually github.com slash boiter slash SCC. We use this Go program uh, to calculate uh, complexity. Um, it's uh, basically counting physical lines of code, blank lines, comment lines, uh, and the goal is to be a code counter and also perform a Kokomo calculation like slow count and to estimate the complexity of uh, similar to cyclomatic complexity calculators. In short, one tool to rule them all. And so we use this Go program um, called SCC to generate um, our code complexity information. And this is, a, you can see it has, um, you know, over a thousand commits, very active uh, seven days ago. 12 branches, 32 releases. Um, so it's a, it's a pretty well-established and I think one of the most robust um, complexity calculators out there. So that's why we use um, Boiter SCC um, as a Go program that Augur makes a call to um, uh, So we select the path, repo path, generate value data and then generate value data runs SCC. Um, so it, it essentially says uh, SCC bin is a parameter in the auger.config.json for the um, value worker. And you just have to specify, it's usually your home directory slash go slash bin slash SCC. Um, is where where your um, your your per, the program gets run, and then it takes all of the results and it records um, you know when we ran it, the language, the location, the file name, the lines, the code, the comments, um, blank lines is the blank value, complexity is the complexity, and then we have our Augur metadata here at the end. Um, that we run. There's other data that we could gather. Uh, they actually have a value uh, cost to recreate calculator um, within it, but we haven't implemented that yet. Hmm. Okay. This was interesting. I didn't know.